went is such a different animal, and it really did bring rock and roll into the uh, into the theater. So it made it a completely different experience, and that kind of energy, that visceral feeling, kind of kind of changed theater forever. Which is, I'm sure, a big part of the reason why Jonathan Larson won the Pulitzer Prize. What I love about what Atlanta Opera is doing with this is that we're doing it the original way it was done. In other words, we have a five-piece rock band. You know, we don't have a string section. We're not changing it from the energy of the original. It's, it's an opera company producing it, but the singers are all fantastic young New York Broadway performers that bring that kind of energy to it. You know, I, I believe that the future of performing arts is immersive. And it's in spaces where there's nothing else like that. And spaces like Pullman Yards that are so raw, that are so open to whatever we want to create in it. There's no barrier between the audience and whatever story you're telling them. Rent, premiering in 1996, transposes the Bohemian narrative to the gritty streets of New York City East Village during the HIV crisis of the late 20th century. Jonathan Larson's scores blends rock and pop and musical theater styles to reflect the diverse and vibrant and very often tumultuous world of the characters. I think the thing is that the reason why both La Boheme and Rent became classics is because essentially they're about subjects that anybody can relate to. Today, it's about love and fear and passion and jealousy, you know, just like Shakespearean classics, we still relate to them today. You know, think of Romeo and Juliet. Why is it still relevant, right? It's because it's about these same things um, that, as humans, we all relate to. It's about the human condition. I think for Rent, we want people to live with a sense of empathy, um, with a sense of invigorated engagement with their community, with awareness that HIV is amongst us today, and the understanding that awareness has to be spread in order to save more lives.